Mastering the Command Palette in Microsoft Power Toys, a complete guide. Microsoft Power Toys has long been a toolkit for power users, offering small but powerful utilities that improve productivity on Windows. With version 0.90.0, a standout new feature was introduced, the Command Palette. This tool transforms the way you interact with Windows by turning your keyboard into a universal launcher for commands, files, apps, and system settings. In this guide, we'll walk you through what Command Palette is, how to set it up, and how to use it like a pro. What is the Command Palette? The Command Palette acts as a keyboard-first command launcher similar to what developers may recognize from tools like Visual Studio Code. It eliminates the need to search through menus or click through settings. Key benefits, launch apps, open files, and run system commands, all by typing. Access hidden tools and Windows features quickly. Works entirely without a mouse. Extensible with additional features like math calculations, web search, or window switching. You can think of it as a smarter version of the Windows Run dialog, backed by extensions and PowerToys integrations. Uh, how to install and enable Command Palette. To get started, you'll need to install or update PowerToys to version 0.90.1 or newer. Option one, manual installation. One, visit the PowerToys GitHub page slash github.com slash Microsoft PowerToys slash releases. Download the correct installer for your system. Most users, PowerToys setup.90.1 x64.exe. ARM users, PowerToys setup 0.90.1 arm64.exe. 3. Run the installer and follow the prompts. Option 2. Use Winget Open PowerShell or Windows Terminal and run bash winget install microsoft.powertoys. Enabling command palette. Once installed, 1. Open PowerToys settings. 2. Go to command palette from the left menu. 3. Toggle Enable Command Palette to On. You can also assign a shortcut key. Default is Win Alt Space and customize it. Hashtag using the Command Palette to launch the Command Palette, press your shortcut key, e.g. Win's Alt Space. You'll see a simple search bar pop up. Now you can type commands, key Regedit, Command, MS Config, Search for apps or settings, device manager, control panel, open files uh, and folders, switch between open windows, perform quick math. The interface is designed to be used with the keyboard only, so once the palette is open, you can scroll through results using lockback arrows and press enter to launch. Installing and Managing Extensions The command palette becomes even more powerful with extensions, which are mini plugins that add new search capabilities. Installing Extensions 1. Open Command Palette and type Search for Extensions in the Store. 2. This opens the Microsoft Store and shows available extensions. 3. Install the ones you need, e.g. Currency Converter, System Tools, Web Search, using Winget Advanced. If you prefer using the terminal, bash Winget install Microsoft.PowerToys. Act, hash activating extensions. 1. Open PowerToys settings. 2. Go to Command Palette Extensions. 3. Toggle the switches next to each extension to turn them on or off. You can also remove unused ones from this menu. Practical Use Cases 
Here are real world examples where command palette shines. Run admin tools type and launch. Command MS config event viewer or rigid it without digging through menus. Find and open files, type part of the file name or path and press enter. Use control enter to see options like open file location, copy path, open in terminal. Switch between apps and windows, enable the window walker extension and type part of a window name to instantly jump between running apps. Tash tash perform, perform quick calculations. Type 5823 and command palette shows the result instantly. No calculator app needed. And shashart, search the web. Use the search the web extension. Type in your search term and press enter to launch results in your default browser. Hashert. Optional. Use with mouse or not. While command palette is designed for keyboard use, you can also click with the mouse to select results. You can close it by pressing ESC, clicking outside the palette, pressing control enter for additional options. Customize your shortcut key. You can personalize how you activate the tool. One, go to Power Toys Settings Command Palette. Two, click Activation Shortcut. Three, use a key combination that works for you. Must start with Control, Alt, Win, or Shift. Four, save the new combo. Extra tip. Use elevated permissions for certain tools like Regedit or PowerShell. Press Control Enter instead of just Enter. This runs the command as an administrator. Conclusion Microsoft's command palette is more than just a launcher. It's a productivity booster that brings speed and simplicity to your daily tasks. With easy search, keyboard control, and powerful extensions, it gives you full control over your PC without clicking through layers of settings.